Hi there. While I visit this wonderful place near uh, Melbourne, I want to add value to you. The more clients we serve, and the more we serve the clients, I have come to an understanding that your technical ability alone is not going to help you in getting the job in Australia quickly. What is required more than your technical ability is your soft skills. You have the technical ability, you have the technical skill set, you have the experience, you have the, um, the cred credibility and the, and the credentials because of which you have come to Australia or you will be coming to Australia or you will be granted the PR with that to Australia soon. But that skill alone is not going to help you. What is going to help you is your soft skills more than your hard skills. So skills such as your communication skills, your um, stakeholder management skills, your, uh, your ability to add value to others in a meaningful way, your teamwork, your team, uh, team uh, binding skills, uh, your convincing skills, your negotiation skills, your commitment, your persistence, your resilience, your ability to take risks, your ability to overcome any challenge and find a viable solution, your creativity, your innovativeness. Um, what else can I think of? Um, you know, your professional values, such as your ability to, to do well in a team environment, or you know how to to what extent you can follow the systems and procedures you know le your leadership skill i believe i mentioned that earlier your transferable experiences how you achieved success in the past in in certain areas or in your in your past uh, employments that is also an indication of your future performance so that particular skill is very important so there are lots and lots of other skills you know your negotiation skills for example, um, your, uh, your confidence, your passion in the job that you do, that is what uh, employers will be looking for in you. And in most cases in Australia, your first interview will not be a technical interview. In most cases, it will be um, your, um, the, uh, your the, the first interview will be the HR interview. And then the second interview will be your technical interview. Unlike it happens in most of the uh, countries in the world. So if you can clear your first interview by showing your confidence and your passion in the job that you do or you want to do, the employers will, will want, to, want you to have, uh, you want to have you on board because they know that you already have the technical ability. You already have that potential. But most people lack the, um, the soft skills. Most people do not have the confidence because the reality of life is this. Your confidence will always override or supersede your competence in most cases. So you having just the technical ability is not going to help you as much as it will when you show, when you exuberate, uh, when you exuberate I would say, um, those uh, soft skills while you're talking to the employer, while you're talking to the recruiter. With that, I say goodbye for you, uh, goodbye to you for now, and I will see you in the next video very soon. Bye bye.